When it comes to forgotten cat breeds, the Alaskan Snowcat, a hybrid from the 90s made with Silver Persians and Somali cats, is easily one of my favorites. And the first subject of this new series I'll be making on the world of Lost Felida, a series that'll dive into the history of domestic cat breeds and hybrids that have been lost to time. Lost Media, Lost Felida. The names of the people who worked on this project are not stated anywhere on any documents I could find, but a book that mentions the Alaskan snowcat says the breeders were from Minnesota and Florida, so it seems the elusive Florida man might be at it again. Breeders at the time set out to create a heavy-boned, thick-furred, silvery-colored, round-headed cat that also had the natural grace and beauty of a Somali, similar to the Siberian forest cat. Their silver Persian blood did in fact make them stronger than the Somali, but their incredible Increased weight decreased their jumping ability. Noted as being laid back, they were reportedly very friendly and enjoyed playing with other cats, dogs, and even young children. But they were not too fond of loud noises and did not do well when left alone and unattended to. It appears their inability to standardize the look and color of the breed led breeders to abandon the project in the late 90s to early 2000s, and although there are some rumors stating that research is still being done, the fact there has been no new information released in over 30 years, with a book from 2005 even stating current breeding of the cats could not be confirmed, tells me the project has been long abandoned. Thankfully though, if you can manage to get your hands on a silver Somali, they look practically identical. Congratulations. If this breeding program had ever been completed, it's undeniable this cat would have been the perfect lap cat, and you can practically feel how soft their fur is through the screen. And while I'm not a big dog person, huskies are one of my favorite breeds, and their resemblance in their coat is undeniable. Some of these breeds may have made cat ownership into an even better experience. Ultimately though, these breeds were left on the cutting room floor. 